Good morning, everybody. It is officially 11.09. I am ready to start this gorgeous day. It's the first day I'm actually wearing shorts because it's in the 80s. Oh, I love the summer. So anyway, thank you so much for clicking on this video. If you're new to my channel, I do ride-alongs, I do Uber Eats, I do DoorDash, and I multi-app between both of those platforms. So I teach you tricks and trades and tips along the way. So if you are a gig worker, you're gonna wanna smash that subscribe button on the bottom. I am trying to get to those thousand subscribers, so I need everybody's help to do so. Also, I'm trying to get to 100 thumbs up on this video, so please make sure that you smash that thumbs up button on the bottom while you're there. So guys, I am so ready to kick off today. I am coming to you from a gorgeous New Jersey, so let's go have some fun today. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Let's go make some money. As you can see, I'm at McDonald's, so that's my first order of the day. This is a really good way to start off the day. $9.98 going 1.8 miles. Oh yeah, a really good way to start off the day. So that's my first order of the day. I'm only two cars behind in the drive through so I am just waiting for my food to come. So anyway, it's a good way to kick off today. Good first order of the day. And we're gonna go make some money today. Hey guys, I'm almost at my next destination, but I'm gonna take this $8.78, 3.5 miles.
Okay, you guys, here's my next order. It is a batched order. It is Panera and a local burrito place. 5.8 miles, $18.50. Woohoo! I am totally taking this bad boy. Every single day 
as long as it takes me to do it. So here's my positivity. Go out there and just do it. Don't give up. Don't get frustrated, even though it's very easy to do. But don't give up. Don't get frustrated. You've got this. You've got the grind. Just go out and do it. <laughs> address attached to your order except for Belford, <laughs> New Jersey. Oh my god. So can you tell me your address so I can plug it into my GPS? Mm. Yes, I'm so sorry. It's 153. Okay, give me a couple of minutes and I'll be there shortly. Thanks so much. Take your time. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Okay, I'm on my way, guys. <laughs> Taking it. 
Let's go make that money. Hi, thanks for calling Uber Eats Support. My name is Angela. Tell me how can I help you tonight? Hi, Angela. I'm doing an order for Brendan S to going from Panera. He just messaged me that he has a change of address. All right, ma'am. And so do you have the new address? Yeah. And are you able to proceed to a new address? Um, yes, that's fine. All right, ma'am. Because when you do that, we usually would like keep a compensation for proceeding to a new address and but it depends, okay? okay. Uh, I'm going to send information to your respective team that is in charge to recalculate the distance and the time that it took to you to proceed to a new address. And you will receive the, probably will receive the compensation once the order has been delivered. Okay. Okay? All right, ma'am. Let me check something else. And uh, while I send information, can I place you hold for two minutes? Sure, thank you. Thank you, ma'am. I'll be back. Thank you. Okay, so while she has me on hold, so the customer contact me. I'm, I just pulled up to Panera. It's a double, it's a batched order, $22. It was going eight miles, but who freaking cares? It's $22. So the as soon as I'm pulling in, the customer messaged me that they're not at their address. They're at another dress which I'm hoping is closer to be honest with you because it's literally maybe three miles away so I'm hoping it's actually closer than further away so fingers crossed I don't know we'll see anyway so I'm calling support right now to see well first of all so they know the change of address so they have obviously a tracker on me that's first thing but sometimes like the lady said, they compensate you for doing a change of address. So anyway, that's the main reason why I am calling. And we're listening to fantastic elevator music. I feel like whenever you have to call support, it's like, ugh, because you feel like it's going to take like forever. I'm pretty sure they're as quick as I possibly can. But at the same time, you just, like, I'm at Panera. Like, I just want to go in and grab the order and go on my merry way, but I feel like if I didn't do this and take care of this, then I, it would have been even more of a disaster, so. Yes, I can, thank you. Thank you so much for the light. All right, ma'am, I already sent the information to a team, okay? It can take up to 10 to 15 minutes after the order has been delivered to receive the compensation, okay? Okay, do you know how much it is by any chance? Me? Do you know how much it is by any chance? Uh, how much is the compensation? Yes. Uh, Four dollars. No? Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. So I can proceed ahead, correct? Yes. Yeah, no. Okay, thank you so much for your help. I appreciate it. So, uh, all right. So I don't know if you have any other question about this. Nope, I'm good. Thank you. Have a wonderful evening. Okay, ma'am. Thank you, you too. Okay. So, if that is all, I have to say goodbye and thanks for calling nobody support. And also, you will receive a survey with a simple question at the end of the call, okay? Okay, thank you. Bye bye. All right. Bye bye, ma'am. Yeah. Okay, let me go in and finally get the Panera. <laughs> okay, you guys, here is my nine o'clock update. So I am right where I should be at this point at night. So that's good news. I just took an order for five guys. It's $12 and 16 cents. It was going 3.3 miles. Yeah, 3.3 miles. So score on that one. So I am on the home stretch. I am almost there, an hour to go. So guys, let me go into five guys and let me keep going for tonight. Okay, you guys, I am ready to call it a night. I will recap you guys later on. Hello everybody, I'm back. I am ready to recap the day. I was so excited that I got to share my positivity with you guys yesterday. So keep the grind on, keep motivated, keep those goals and keep making those goals and then just keep it positive. So I had two customer issues that were wrong, well, one was a wrong address and one didn't give me an address at all. So we resolved those yesterday. So anyway, let's dive right into my totals from yesterday. 
So we are going to start with Uber first. So I did $90.35 on Uber yesterday. I did six trips all together with Uber. And then with DoorDash, DoorDash was my winner yesterday. So I did $65 in the afternoon. I turned around and did another $60.75 and in the evening so my total for doordash was a hundred and twenty five dollars and seventy five cents well when you add everything together i did two hundred and sixteen dollars yesterday i stayed out until about ten thirty because i was gonna achieve that two hundred and sixteen dollars so i stayed out until ten thirty so i worked eight and a half hours yesterday so eight and a half hours into the 216, I did $25.41 an hour yesterday. So I did 14 DoorDash deliveries. I did six Uber deliveries yesterday. So a total of 20 deliveries yesterday. So 20 deliveries into the $216. I did on average $10.80 a delivery yesterday. So guys, those are my total. So everybody, if you are new to my channel, I do DoorDash, I do Uber Eats, I multi-app between both of those apps, and I do ride-alongs. I do videos four to five, sometimes six days a week. So if you are a gig worker, you're going to want to smash that subscribe button. I'm trying to get to those thousand subscribers and I need all of you guys help to get me there. Also on this video I'm trying to get to a hundred thumbs up so don't forget to smash that thumbs up button also while you're down there. And that is all I have for you guys today. So guys thank you so much for watching this video until the end. Remember if you are working, if you're driving, please stay healthy, please stay safe. I will see you in the next video. Remember, kindness is always free and peace out.